All right, what is going on guys? It's Apollo one and today we are back with another gameplay on black ops 3 this time with the weevil on the map Nuketown now today you're watching a hundred and thirty one kill gameplay in Domination which is very very impressive even on Nuketown 131 kills is not exactly the easiest thing to get now today's gameplay is from someone a little bit different No, it is not a carnage member. So you're probably like what what the hell are you talking about? Like what is going on right now? Who who could it be? Who could it be if it's not a Carnage member? Like, who, who is this from? Well, today we have a special guest, and his name is Sore General, the overall leader of Sore Sniping. Now, once again, you're probably like, what are you talking about, Apollo? A sniper? Like, a, a sniper from Sore and the, the leader of Sore? Yes, that's right. He does more than sniping. He pub stomps as well. So, yes, I'm here to uh, introduce a someone a little bit different. You know, he's gonna have a little special. So, hopefully you guys do enjoy this gameplay by Sore General. General, if you want to check out his channel, his link will be right at the top of the description below. You can go over there and check him out. I'm sure you guys are familiar with Sore Sniping. Uh, but today I'm going to be talking a little bit about his past. And I think you guys will enjoy this story because probably a lot of people don't know, uh, from the pub stomping community at least, don't know exactly his story and who he was, especially if you are a newer person to the whole YouTube scene. Now, Sore General, or General, used to be known as Saint Jumpshot back in the day. This was like back in Modern Warfare 3 times. And uh, back in Modern Warfare, Fair 3, Saint Jumpshot was not exactly the most popular person, but that's okay. He was he was big in the community, and he was uh, someone that ran support. He helped out larger people get gameplays in Modern Warfare 3. Uh, for an example, Jay Nasty. He ran support for Jay Nasty. And by the way, I'm going to only be talking about the things that I know of that I remember from back then, uh, so I might miss out parts of his past, but it's only from what I know. Uh, so he ran support for people and helped them get gameplays, and as he did that, obviously he progressed as a player, and he was obviously already a pretty decent player at Modern Warfare 3. And as time went on, he was actually becoming a better and better player and he was able to actually start getting gameplays on his own and people were running support for him and he was getting gameplays. So uh, that's kind of how he started off as a pub stomper because he was a pub stomper at one point, St. Jumpshot. And, uh, <laughs> and then things kind of progressed. He had his own channel and he actually at one time was a part of Carnage back, back during Black Ops 2, I believe. He joined Carnage as a pub stomper um, and I, some of his games plays are still on Carnage from back way, way long time ago. The one that I personally remember was 100 plus kills on uh, Meltdown and Domination. So if you guys want to go back and check that video out, I'm sure you could find it. If I'm able to find it, I'll link it down in this video's description, but I don't know if I will or, or not, uh, but you can probably check it out if you want. Uh, but yeah, then he became a pretty big figure in the pub stomping community, and he did a lot for the community, and he started something called the COD Showdown. And basically what the COD Showdown was, was a, a, a bunch of different teams that, uh, mostly consisted of large figureheads in the community. People like Birdman, uh, Jay Nasty, uh, I don't even remember the other people. There was a, just a bunch of people, people from Amp and stuff, and a couple guys from Carnage, uh, and it was just mainly, like, larger people in the community and outside of the pub stomping community as well. And, uh, basically there were teams, and they faced off against each other in competitive matches. And this was very, very successful. I believe, I don't remember the exact numbers, because this was a long time ago, but I believe it had, like, over a thousand viewers at at some points, maybe even like 2000, and this was live. It was all live streamed and codcasted by professional codcasters, I believe, from what I remember. And uh, it was very, very entertaining. It was a really, really cool thing. It had its ups and downs. It was getting like hit off. It wasn't always able to stay online, which was a big um, issue with it. And also, teams broke apart. And there was a lot of arguments and disagreements, and that kind of got in the way, which was really unfortunate because it was a really cool thing and kind of brought the community together in some ways. And it was, it was an awesome thing. It was super, super cool, and personally, I want to thank Sword General for doing that uh, back in our past, because it was something very, very cool, and I don't know if people were really that appreciative uh, at the current point and realized how, how cool that really was for our community, because we haven't had anything like that since. Maybe we will in the near future. I don't know. But, thank you Sword General for doing that, and this gameplay, man, you should maybe come, you should maybe look, look into coming back to the pub stomping scene, become a pub stomper, get that AK out, and just start getting gameplays go back to Modern Warfare 3, drop those solo triple Moabs, I don't know, uh, but <laughs> this gameplay is definitely impressive, so if you want to check out his channel, it will be linked down in the description below, but yes guys, he is doing big things over at Source Sniping, he's doing a phenomenal job with the team, he is making it very, very good, and he's improving uh, everything that has to do with Source, so he is doing a very good job, and uh, yeah, so that's that's pretty much it guys, hopefully you're having a fantastic day, if we could shoot for a thousand likes on today's video, that'd be absolutely insane, of course, if you are new to Carnage Clan, 
again, make sure to hit that subscribe button, stick around for more content. And once again, check out Sora General's channel. His link will be right at the top of the description below. So anyways, guys, hope you're having a great day once again, and I will talk to you later.